the wrong button. Ah, uh, guide arrow. Ah, uh, we'll go there next. Gotta go to places. Let me be. The arrow's pointing that way. Go that way. Ah, right. I think it's a camera store. Yeah. Camera star, camera star, camera star. Ah, uh, come on, Frankie, you're gonna die. Oh, Frankie, you're gonna die. Lovely. Okay, I'll get the blender first. Should really put these in order, like, they should have. Blender, blender, Let's go head over to the food court. Food court. Hey, look. It's big smiley face. I'm a fucking prisoner. Don't fucking mess with me. I'll cut your face in. Hello? Oh. Frank, I don't know why you said hello over there. There's no one left. Go right, the chap. I've never done that. Well, I have done it. It's really hard. You gotta flick the pad while pressing X. It's easy to do, but you gotta be on the wall. It's crap. Oh, okay. Back up. No, wait then. Before I level up to this is the be best place to be when I just left now. There's a gym right next there. Uh, just do that every time, every day. You level up Frank quite easily. Right. Oh, sick oh, guy. Wait there. Mm. Mm. Wait, Requesting emergency backup. <sighs> Jesus. Are you serious? Kill all your fucking friends now. One at a time, please. Bastard. Right. Lucky I got plenty of drink here. Yeah. Milk, milk, milk. Who doesn't know? Ah, oh, shit me up by the then. Yogurt's no good. Need milk. Well, I don't need a sniper. I need a milk or yoga, whatever you want to call it. Alright, here we go again. Twenty minutes, so guys. Whoa. Oh, that's Jesse, the fucking ugly bitch. Can't believe she turned. Oh, see, I have a fucking little cop somewhere. Oh. Fuck, he's right for there. Oh, well. oh wrong one. This one's downstairs, so fuck that one. No way. Yes, that one. 
Enemy emergency backup. Requesting emergency backup. Come in, then. Found him. Pricks. Don't let him get away. So, yeah, food shop. Let's go to the food shop. Food shop. Food shop. Give her the stuff and uh, should be right. I have to collect queens, eh? Ah, oh, this is the odd bit now. Joe Manny's in here now, guys. I, I might as well pull out my Mega Blast now. There's laws in here. I think that's it, actually. Well, I know you're lucky. I'm glad we're in the full court. I don't really need these. As long as I got the Mega Blast on, I'm alright. Because Mega Blaster is the one. That is it. No guide arrow. Right, we'll have to go back to Isabella. See, this is the problem. See, with, with this game, you got to remember what your way back. Now, I shit myself before, and I went down there. And that took me back, um, that took me to the car park area. Well, fucking thousands are down there. Oh, look, it's a crazy psychopath. Ride that bike now. Quickest way to get there is wrong with that fucking bike. Isabella, what are you doing? There you go. Do you see how quick uh, I just pull all that stuff there? Well, it's up to you guys. You can just um, go back and forth, back and forth, but it's easy to just collect them straight away. So, this drug that stops the parasite growth. Have you ever made it before, or is it just a theory? When I was working in the medical lab, my brother asked me to research a method of suppressing the parasite. Of course, back then, we didn't extract the hormones directly. We synthesized them in the lab. <laughs> so, he was looking to protect himself from his own terrorist scheme. He wanted a way out, is that it? I don't know! I know he didn't bring the drug with him here. I have no idea what he intended to use it for. You think I'm just making excuses, but Carlito kept things from me. Carlito.
Even if this, uh... Even if you do manage to make this drug, it won't completely cure me, will it? I'm afraid not. When the effect wears off, the parasite will develop as it normally would, continuing the zombification process. Fat lot of good that does me. I've got now. Well, Frank, come on now, but I'll shape up. This is all I need as far as supplies are concerned. Now, all we need are some queens. Yeah, uh. Listen. Just how long do you suppose your drug will prevent me from turning into a walking corpse? During my research, I was never able to conduct proper clinical studies. To a certain extent, the period of effectiveness depends on each patient's physiology. It could be a year, maybe only a week. There's no way to tell for sure. Fantastic. So... I'll be a walking zombie time bomb. A time bomb? What? Once the drug's development was complete, Carlito poured his energy into starting an NPO dedicated to helping war orphans. We had 50 doses of the drug prepared. Not long after that. The NPO managed to find homes for a large group of children. Want to guess just how many? Oh my god. saying he infected these kids and then gave them your drug? That he made 50 little ticking time bombs? I don't know. I just don't know. It is possible, though. Look at this. New York, D.C., L.A. These kids are spread all over the country. If your theory is right, the entire country could be crawling with zombies by now. I don't know what's worse. That we don't know for sure, that we can't warn anyone about this. Well, what we need to do right now is prepare the hormone and get you taken care of. Right then, guys. This is the end of part one of overtime mode i really hope you're enjoying stay tuned for part two of overtime mode and i'm frank west for hmm. journalist a fucking serial killer i got a camera it's nice isn't it peace guys peace